Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Sarah Starr, and I hope you guys are all doing well. So, like I promised, I have a Goodwill haul to show you. Um, you guys, I went Sunday and Monday, okay? Because Sunday is the additional 50% off certain certain tag colors. You know, um, it just varies each Sunday. And then um, Monday was the additional 50% off um, sale that they were having. So um, it's not every Monday. It was just a special occasion that they were having it. And um, you guys, I, okay, I don't have everything here because some of the things I've already washed because my kids wanted to wear them. Um, and some of the things, um, but literally within two days, I spent between Sunday and Monday, I spent about $80, $90 at Goodwill. So, and keep in mind, Monday I spent $43, so it would have been 80 something if it was full price, because Monday I got everything, Monday got everything 50% off. So, um, so let's go ahead and get started. I'm, I'm so excited to show you, and yes. So, the first thing I have, actually I'm gonna talk about it while the video is gonna show me, or show what I bought. It's actually on my daughter's wall already. Um, I bought a huge, print of a cat, a Siamese cat and a butterfly. I bought this on Sunday. Now it was not on sale at all. It was not a, um, the, the tag color that was on clear or on 50% off, but you guys, it was only $10 and 49 cents. So this thing is humongous. It's an oil painting. The frame alone is gorgeous. Like the whole thing is such a statement piece for her room. And you know, we love cats. And um, I just thought it was so precious and so beautiful. And it was actually an oil painting. And originally this probably would have been two, three upwards um, because somebody actually painted it, painted it, it's signed. And um, I'm trying to find more information about this painting, um, but it is absolutely gorgeous. And I paid $10 and 49 cents for it. So I'm so excited, so excited to have that. So I wanted to, um, so I wanted to put that in the video so you guys can see that because if I were trying to hold it here, it'd be like, it's bigger than me. I mean, it's huge. So, and pretty heavy. So, um, yeah, so that's the first thing I bought. Okay. For $10 and 49 cents. All right. So now, the next thing I bought was, I have a couple things in front of me and then a lot of stuff on the floor here. Okay, so I'll go ahead and show you this book really quick. This was a, a, something we purchased on Monday and it was a Scholastic book, okay? And it was, um, let's see, the tag was already worn off um, because what I did is when I got home, I Cloroxed it and my daughter must have taken the tag off. But what I do, when I buy books at Goodwill, um, I Clorox it you know, as much as I can. So this was only a dollar for this book, you guys. And um, so that's an amazing deal because retail, this is $8.99. And um, it's just kind of a, um, you know, just like a comic book type thing. I'm not quite sure what it is, but um, it's by Scholastics, um, Scholastic book, books. So anyway, all right, so a dollar for that. All right, the next thing we picked up, um, this was a purchase on Sunday. Now the tag, um, I can't remember back what what color was on sale, um, but when I get to that bag, I think it'll it'll my memory will be jogged and I can remember. But I know this was full price because and this is a blue tag, so it was not a blue tag. Um, this was only three dollars and forty nine cents, you guys, and it's a radio TV. Okay, so. My son found this actually because he came with me on Sunday. He went shopping with me. Now it doesn't work, you guys. I didn't know. I didn't realize that again, as I always mentioned before. When you buy things like Goodwill, sometimes it's just, it's a dud. It doesn't work. It's just, you know, it's unfortunate when that happens. I, I feel sad when I like lose my, I feel like I lose my money when I buy something that doesn't work. But, but, um, the radio works. So this is a good thing to have, like if a power outage were to happen kind of thing. So I'll go ahead and show it to you. It's a Casio, which is a great brand. And so as you can see, it would flip down, this piece would flip down and there would be your TV. So it tries to work. And my husband and I think if we like gotten closer, like outside, the antenna is perfectly intact. If we went outside and tried to get closer, maybe we'd get a signal. Um, Cause it was trying to find something um, when we were looking at it. Um, but what it's a color TV, so I gotta play with it some more around my house. Maybe, maybe I can find a signal. But you see how that line's going through it. Um, so, but the next thing it's really cool though is it, it flips up. It flips up, and then it has a radio. So um, that in itself is great. So. You know, just to have a radio that just, it takes only three batteries. Um, again, in case of an emergency, we've got, you know, communication with the outside world, you know, like if, 
you know, the power went out and our cell phones weren't working or something like that. So this was only $349. I don't know if I mentioned that before, but hey, that is a really good deal. Okay, the next thing I picked up, this is a bummer buy. <laughs> and I'm kind of embarrassed to show you guys, but I'm going to show you because this is kind of what happens sometimes at Goodwill. Um, I think I was getting tired towards the end of my shopping and I was like, okay, um, and I was kind of like on that 50% off, everything is such an amazing deal kind of, you know, thing going on. And so I picked up this because I love lighthouses and I love the whole idea of like the birds, go, you know, they're, they're um, swarming around the lighthouse and it's a Christmas lighthouse. It's actually missing something up here, um, but you know, okay, so the thing is, it's, it takes batteries and I came home and it's supposed to like move around and probably sing music or something for Christmas, but you guys, it doesn't work. It doesn't work. I know. I'm so bummed. So it was $350, marked $350, and then I got half off. So then that would be half of $350 is, um, oh gosh, here we go again with my math. So half of $350, whatever that is, it's like $1.25 or something like that. So not bad. Um, I can just use this as decoration. We do have like a beach themed bathroom, so I could always use it for Christmas time, but I feel sad that it didn't work. Even though it's $1.25, I don't want to buy things that don't work, you know what I mean? But, 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 there's a but. Um, it has, it has a plug in here for a, um, something six volt, and I need to find one and see if we have one um, in our storage, and it may just work with a six volt plug-in because there's an, like a thing you can plug adapter. I don't know what this term is called. So I'm hoping it works, you guys, for $1.25. Again, if not, it's okay. It's not the end of the world, but um, I don't want to collect things that aren't working. Do you know what I mean? So yeah, so $1.25, um, it kind of makes me want to like second guess when I buy electronic things like this because it's kind of like kind of two for two. Like this is half working. I mean, I don't really think the TV, I'm not sure if the TV is going to completely work for us and this is like not working at all. So, and I bought one other item that isn't working either. So, I kind of was striking out with the electronics department for sure, okay. But I wanna show you, so um, just to let you know, you know, what happened there. Okay, the next thing I picked up is right in front of me and this was not on sale, at, it was, I bought it on Sunday. You guys, this is amazing, <laughs> okay. So, this was, okay. We couldn't decide, the manager couldn't decide, we didn't know what it said. It said, it looks like it says either $1.49 for this or $4.49. So they gave it to me for $2.49. So there's the, so what it is, it is, it's a, um, there's the price in the corner. But it's, um, I've never seen anything like this before. Um, it's kind of like 90s, 80s, 90s design, because look at the font on it. So this box has been around a while, and uh, but it's a bunch of gift bags on a roll, on a roll, and there are a bunch of gift bags. Like, I, how like cool is that? So, I mean, amazing. So, let me go ahead and show you. And there's a couple things like somebody, I don't know, like there's something else in there. I don't know what it is. It's like shower treads or something. I don't know. But um, okay. So let me open the box for you to show you. Um, and it was originally. Okay, 1986, you guys. This goes way back, way back. This is 1986 on the top. So I was six years old um, when this was approximately made because it says 1986 Francis Meyer Incorporate, Incorporation. I mean, they don't look that old, but maybe so, 1986. So I'm gonna show you this. It doesn't have any type of odor from being in storage or anything like that. They don't, you know, they look like pretty new pretty new condition. Somebody took care of this. Um, so all it is is, let's see, I can't even take it. The roll is like actually stuck in there. So what you do is you, I guess you feed it like a roll of foil, you know, it comes out of the bottom like that, just like that. And um, then it rips off and you get, it's a huge bag and I'll show you where it rips off at. Okay. The uh, perforated lines. Oh, this says 1991 on here. Okay. So it's a little bit um, younger than I thought. Okay, so look at how tall this bag is, you guys. Okay, 1991. All right, so this is 
amazing, this bag. Like, these bags are awesome. So, and it comes with all of them. I don't know how many, I couldn't figure it out. There's probably one, two, three, four, five, maybe six, seven of these, but they're huge. There's the rest in there for um, $2.50. I was fine by that because that is such a unique looking bag and it's gonna hold a lot. Like, and you can like cinch it up with a really pretty ribbon and I'm excited about that. So easy wrapping, you know? Especially for those like odd shaped, you know, items that you try to wrap and they start poking through the wrapping paper. This is really gonna be a um, great thing to have. Okay, the next thing you guys, I have so much stuff. Like I, <laughs> like grab a snack right now if you want, and grab a drink. It's like, you're gonna be here for a while <laughs> if you wanna watch this because I got a lot of stuff guys, a lot. Okay, the next thing I have is this adorable, I know I, you're probably like, why are you saying adorable? I think it's a cute little adorable witch hand. And it's supposed to work, guys, but this guy does not. This one disappointed me, too. So it's not marked. They actually had to tell me. I bought this on Monday on the 50% off. It was, um, they sold it to me for $2.49 and an additional 50% off. So I paid um, like $1.25 for this. And it, we put the batteries in it and the motor's like kind of working. It's trying to like open and close the hand, but it just, it's not, it's not there. Something short in it, shorted or whatever. So the idea of it's really cute and I'm going to use it for display. Um, you know, it could even hold, well, you can't see it has like little rollers on it. It's meant to like roll across the table. So it's going to have to be displayed like that, but it's still really fun, you guys. So $1.25, it's a really detailed, um, witch hand. So yeah, so I thought that was fun. Okay, it'd be even more fun if it worked, right? Yeah, I know. So the next thing I picked up was, we got a lot, guys. We got a lot, we got a lot. Okay, the next thing I picked up was, what is this now? Forgot, forgot already. Oh, just a um, black t-shirt. Now this was, I believe it was the brown tag. Yeah, this was the brown, the brown tag, sorry, brown tags were 50% off on Sunday. So this only cost me a dollar for a long sleeve black tee for one of my daughters. So like I said, these t-shirts, the basic tees are so, they come in handy so much. Now these were bought on Monday, the 50% off sale. How adorable are these? Okay. Let me just like get in closer so you can see the cute sequins all over it. These are made by mustard seed, um, the brand mustard seed. And, um, you guys, these were 50% off from $3.99, so they're only $2. And they're so cute. They're for my um, daughter, Macy. So really cute, like summer shorts, so cute. Okay, now I actually found a couple, two dresses for myself on the Monday sale. So I found, I found this beautiful dress. It's kind of dirty. So I tried it on for you guys, but it's really dirty. So, I mean, it needs to be washed. Um, I tried it on over my clothes, but, um, yeah, it needs to be washed, but it fits, um, and, but I need to wash it. <laughs> okay, it's got like some type of random stain on the front, so, all right, I mean, it'll come out. It's like dirt or something, but anyway, look at how cute this is, you guys. I love the ballet, like, ruched top up there in the front, and I like the pattern of the high-waisted, and it goes all the way like this, and you guys, it's got pockets, like bonus, so it's got pockets. There they are, the pockets right there, okay? So they go right in, pockets on each side. So it's a dress with two pockets, and I love it so much. And it was made by, it doesn't say, it just, just says XL Made in China. So I don't know who who makes this dress, but it was half off, so it was cost me um, $3.50, $3.50 for a dress that I can literally just throw on you know, because it's a complete dress. Like, it's not, you know, I mean, I could even add a belt to it if I wanted, but really, really cute, guys. Really cute. And it's like, um, I think the sleeves go to like, you know, like this, the way I'm wearing this one. I think they're kind of almost three-quarter, almost, I think. Okay, there's that one. Then I picked up this bingo set for Christmas time. This was 50% off on Monday sale. So it was 69 cents, I brought down half off of that. So about 30, 35 cents for this. And it's a complete bingo set Christmas cards, or sorry, Christmas themed bingo set for 35 cents. I mean, great rainy day activity at Christmas time on Christmas break. Um, the next thing I picked up, I love this so much. Um, 
this was Monday's purchase as well. I have things like combined in these bags because I took them out and looked at them. So I'm sorry there's not like Sunday and Monday separated. Um, okay, so I bought this. All right, guys, you ready for this? Look at how cute is that? So you make me ridiculously, ridiculously happy. I love that. I love that so much. I love the chain on it. I love the font on this. I love the colors. I love the gold. I love everything about it. It was half off of $3.49, so it cost me $1.25, I guess, right? Again, I'm so bad with my math, but anyway, really beautiful, right? It's made by Home Garden, um, and it's just so, anyway, I thought that is so beautiful. Like the whole, the I love, you guys know I love signs around my house. I just have so many signs. I love positive, beautiful sayings. So you make me ridiculously happy. So I love that. I love that. So yeah, that's a good one. I think a good sign. Okay. Yeah. I just like to look around and just like, you know, like see things that are like positive and like beautiful, like beautiful signs. Okay. The next thing I picked up, this was a purchase on 50% off day on Monday. You guys look at how adorable this long glitter skirt is. It's uh, made by Cat and Jack, which is of course Target. It's a long um, tulle skirt, goes all the way down to your feet. This is for one of my daughters to wear. And it was, um, you know, now that I'm thinking about this, I don't think I got 50% off on this. Yes, I don't think so. Because it says kids costume, I didn't look at the receipt. I think I paid full price for this. Bummer, because I found this with the kids clothes, so it was just misplaced. I doubt I got 50% off on this, because like I said, they don't discount um, Halloween costumes. So, um, and, until less, it's like the end of the season after Halloween. So anyway, I got this for, I think, $4.99, which is still fine by me. It's a gorgeous skirt. I could not make this if I tried for $4.99. So it's gorgeous, I love it, okay. The next thing I picked up, this was half off. This was only $1. It's a little faded, but it's super cute. Little like sporty tee. I like the little, the um, it's Old Navy. It's made by Old Navy. And I just love that little like 70s look tee. It's so cute. And it kind of looks like Harry Potter. So when we go to Harry Potter, my daughter could totally rock this and like totally look like a Harry Potter shirt because it looks like the colors of the Harry Potter um, merchandise, like the clothing. And um, so yeah, bought that for a dollar. Okay, now we got some more bags to go through, guys. Okay, now here is, let's go through this bag. Okay, I got this on Monday as well. This, the 50% off sale. This is Dragon Hunter. It was normally $3.99, that's the price. So I got it for $2. I've never ever seen this movie, but I thought this would be a great, Thing to have to watch because we have a DVD in our car um, or SUV so when we're driving to Universal Studios we can watch my kiddos can watch this um, on the, in the car so you know something to pass the time so yeah two dollars for that then oh here's one of the receipts <laughs> you guys yeah that's a lot okay let me see I think I paid full price for that I think I think I think let me just double check because it should say $4.99 and nope, I got it for good. I got half off that skirt, the star skirt. I got it for $2.50. So yes, I feel better. Okay. The next thing I picked up was this digital photo ornament. And I haven't even opened this to even see what it looks like or anything, but I'm like, that looks pretty cool. So you, and it's made by Kohl's. I think it was a Kohl's. Yeah. Kohl's for $29.99 originally. Wow. And I got it for, so it was $3.50. So I got it for Dollar twenty-five again? Dollar two dollar two two fifty. No, like a dollar seventy-five, right guys? I don't know. So um three fifty half off. Okay. So it holds up to sixty of your favorite photos. I'm gonna go ahead and open it now and see what it looks like because I have not opened it yet. And I'm hoping it's actually an ornament in there, <laughs> not something else, because you never know. Oh wow, this was like never used. Nice, it was never used. Never used, never ever used. That's amazing. Oh wow, that is absolutely amazing. There's the, you know, the screen. There's the top of it that holds to the tree. And then there's the instructions. That's fabulous, that is so fabulous, I love that. 
Oh my gosh. Like that's like almost Dollar Tree prices for this ornament that's gonna, you know, I can put on my tree and put all the family photos on there and stuff. I just love that so much. Okay, so the next thing I got was this for my son. It was just a, you know, regular long sleeve, like a uh, fake faux looking long sleeve. Like it's a, you know, two, like it's a two for one type thing. So it looks like, you know what I'm trying to say? It's like, it looks like he's wearing two shorts, but he's just wearing one. And um, this looks brand new, honestly. It looks really brand new. It's made by Garanimals, which is Walmart. And um, I got it for all, all of $1. <laughs> One dollar. I love it. I love it. So I'm just going to wash that and he can wear that. Then I bought this. This is totally cool, guys. Harry Potter again. Love it so much. Okay. So this was one dollar because it was half off. One ninety nine. One dollar. It's going to be so cute for Harry Potter World when we go to Universal Studios. I think that's so awesome. Okay. Then I found another dress for me. I'm so excited about this is a Kohl's dress. Um, this is Lauren Conrad. And you guys know I love denim so much. It's like, denim is my color. I think this is my color that I should wear. Like, this, you know how you do like your, um, have your, um, what is it called? It was very popular in like the 80s. My mom did it where you have your colors checked or like, you know, what's the most flattering on you. So like your, if you're warm or if you look better in warm colors or cool colors, that type of thing. I think blue, I would be like totally blue would be like the top of what um, is my color. I really do think this is my best color. So I was really happy to find it in a dress. So um, I've tried it on over my clothes. It totally fits and um, it's just super, super cute. And the back has like a cute little tie in the, on the neck. And again, Lauren Conrad and I paid only because it was half off. I paid $3.50. It's like a chambery, like a real soft material. Okay, you guys are gonna love this. I just know it. I found, found, I found, I found a bl another blanket scarf. I am so excited. I love blanket scarves so, so much. Look at how gorgeous this mustard yellow is. Oh, I love it so much. Okay, so, you know, there it is against my skin tone. I think yellow is another one of my colors. And I'm not... <laughs> I hope this does not sound like I'm like vain or something. I just um, think I've always been told yellow is a good color for me and, um, you know, the denim. So that's why I just wanted to say that out loud that I love yellow and that kind of thing. But um, it was $2.99. So I paid $1.50 for this scarf. Isn't that absolutely incredible? I mean, I cannot wait to wear this. And I know, I know, I know, I have to do a video for you guys of the blankets, how I tie these scarves. I keep meaning to, I am so sorry. I will wash this. I have three blanket scarves, no, four blankets, five blanket scarves, I think now. I will do a tutorial how I do that, psh, the whole thing on it. But I just wanna wash these and then that way I feel, you know, I don't wanna put this on if it hasn't been washed. But look at how pretty that is. Oh, I just love it. It screams Thanksgiving, it screams, fall, it screams, harvest, you know, everything. Love it. Okay. Now, I also got this bag for my daughter and uh, Monokuru, let's see, Monokuru, I can't say it right now, Monokuro Boo. It's like a really darling book bag, you guys. And um, I think it's like from Japan. It's beautiful. And it's even got the little pig, little, um, I looked on like websites and these sell, <coughs> excuse me, these, these particular, I have a tickle, excuse me. <coughs> I think like something dusty got in my throat. Um, these sell, these sell for not, I didn't, I didn't find this particular one, but I found this designer and they, they go not like super, super cheap. So I think these, you know, used, I think they did a really good job. Um, it doesn't have a tag on it. So they priced it for me, for me in the front. I paid full price of what, they, because I bought it on Sunday and I got it for $3.49, which is a really great deal. It's like pretty much in perfect condition. It's not faded. It's not dirty. But you guys, I will throw it in the wash. I have to throw, I have to throw it in the wash just to make sure it's clean. So yeah, so I hope it doesn't like get faded after I wash it, but I think it will be fine. Okay, then I got a lot more guys. So, okay, I picked up this. How precious is this? It's a flag holder for your front, you know, I have a flagpole thing in my front of my house, you know, for the 
you know, different holidays. Um, so it's like really cute little pumpkin, the bat. It's like a total, it's made of felt. Um, I just hope it doesn't rain because I don't know how this is going to hold up in the rain. But uh, there it is. So really super, super cute. I think somebody actually just made this. Like, it's actually a really great idea to make it, you know? So, 69 cents, by the way. Bought this on Sunday, 69 cents. Can't go wrong. Okay, I did buy this on, um, was this? Let me see what color tag this was. I think this was my Sunday purchase. No, this was Monday as well. Um, this was 50% off, so it was only, so it was $3.99, so it cost me $2. And I just love it because it's got the cats. And it's like a, um, got the Santa hats on the cats. And it's a hoodie. It's got a hood for $2. It's so precious to wear around the house or like for jammies or out. It's like super, super cute. So I love that. I got that. It's got a cute little like cut on the hem. It's like kind of like, you know, really cute. Okay. Then I picked up just these leggings for my daughter. Leggings are always so easy to like. Uh, they're just, I love like leggings like this because you can wear a dress over it when it's cold outside and then with boots, it looks super cute. And these are like faux jeans and you see how it has that like faux jean print and um, so cute. And these were half off, so they were $2. Okay, now I found this Jenny doll, okay? So I try to look online. I can't find this particular Jenny doll, okay? It has a patent number on the back. Um, and, but they go, these Jenny dolls go for pretty good prices on eBay. Um, she's kind of had not the best care taking care of her. She's a little, um, needs some TLC. I think she got a haircut, um, and is missing her shoes and that type of thing. But it does say on the back, Jenny, G-I-N-N-Y, Vogue Dolls Incorporated, patent number, um, and then just, and then made in the USA. So these are from like the 1950s-ish era and her eyes are permanently closed. So I think they're really cool dolls and I was looking up um, online about them, um, trying to figure out the cost of what this would be if I were to resell it, but it's pretty, you know, it got, it was not treated so well <laughs> over the years cause it was probably played with. But um, regardless, it's super cute and um, I love the little like outfit. It's so cute, the little sailor outfit. So anyway, 49 cents for that. Okay, then let me make some room. Let me close these up. And I'm going to show you this now. This is so cool. Okay, I got this. Thank you, graduation box. Oh my gosh, how awesome is that? It says thank you. And just, you know, so it's got the tassel on there. It's just, you know, tabletop. It's a card holder. And you just open it up like this to redeem your cards. And on the back, or this is made by card box, which I think this, this says Target. It's so funny, I didn't even have to read Target. I knew the font that Target uses. It was originally $8, and I paid, it was half off, I paid, it was $3.49, there's the sticker right there. Half off of $3.49, I think is $1.25, or $1.75, something like that, but oh my gosh. So that is awesome, because my daughter will be graduating sixth grade. Um, and then, you know, and to keep this around for, I have four kids who are gonna be graduating, um, you know, throughout the years and I just, it's a perfect condition. This box is like pristine, pristine. Do you know what? I just really hope, and I just thought about it. When I take this tape off that it doesn't, oh my goodness, I didn't even think about that. Oh, be nice tape, be nice. Okay, it's coming off fine. Yeah, it's coming off. Okay, good. I was worried about that, you guys. Oh good, okay. It's fine, it's totally fine, okay. I was worried that it would take the paper off with it, you know, when I took it off, but thank goodness it doesn't. Okay, I'll finish that later. Okay, the next thing I got was this you guys are gonna love. Okay, it's an Easter egg tree or like an Easter tree. Now this is totally like 80s, 90s <laughs> again, but I love all things old. I love vintage. Um, here's the front, sorry, I don't know if I saw the, showed you the front. Now, it was $3.49, there's the price, and then I paid $1.25 for it. And you know what, guys? This was a Walmart item. It says Walmart $5.96 originally. $5.96, but it's 96 cents. But in like the 90s, this is probably a lot worth more. You know what I mean? Like value. Um, so it's all together, you guys. Everything is in there. There's some ornaments on the bottom, but it's never ever been used. Do you see how the ornaments are all in there together still? 
for a dollar forty nine. I mean, how awesome is that, right? And it's um like they're little wooden ornaments. And so I just love that. And for a dollar forty nine, I love that. So that'll be up at Easter. Had to get that. Had to get that. Okay. The last thing I got is, okay, I got this on Monday on the 50% off sale. Okay, it's super um, bulky and uh, super heavy. Oh, just kidding, guys. <laughs> it's not heavy at all. It is not heavy at all. It's pretty light. It looks heavy, right? Um, and that's disgusting. I just realized there's a spider web on there. Oh, my gosh, that is so gross. Oh, please just let it be a web. Oh my goodness. Okay. Anyway, another surprise from Goodwill. Um, it looks okay. I think, don't think there's anything living on it. This is 1996. It was $3. That's got me creeped out now. <laughs> I am looking to make sure there's no spider who's going to jump on me. Ew, that is so gross. Okay. This was $3.49. Right there, $3.49. And I paid $1.25 for this gorgeous planter with spider webs and all. <laughs> it's ready for Halloween, right? I don't have to wash it if I don't want, but there it is on the inside. But you guys, I was thinking I could chalk paint it, you know, like yellow or something. It'd be super cute for an outside decoration for a, a plant. Uh, what's the word? A pot, you know, for my uh, plants. So anyway, I love it. It's a statement piece, but I'm definitely going to be changing the color of it to either like yellow, mustard seed yellow, or, um, you know, gray even, something um, other than this color. So, but I wanted to show you this. I love it. It's $1.25. Um, so that's it, guys, for my Goodwill haul. I'm so excited with everything I found, and so I'm now, I'm like ready to wash everything, and um, hopefully I didn't bring in a family of spiders in that, um, oh my gosh, in that pot, I just, that planter thing I just brought home. Oh my gosh. Okay. So, um, anyway, yeah. <laughs> All right. Okay. So, um, I had no idea that, that that was there. I've had this sitting here for like two or three days, like, cause I bought this on Monday and today is Wednesday, almost Thursday. So this has been sitting in my house for three days, but you guys, I just think it's old webs, you know, but not like real, act there's no active spiders, it's just webs. But anyway, I don't like webs at all, you know? So um, unless it's Halloween decoration webs. Okay. Yeah. So anyway, um, yeah. So with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this long haul. I know it was a super long one, but I just wanted to combine everything together and show you what I got. And um, yeah. So anyway, guys, thank you so much for being here. And um, I'll see you all really soon with my next haul. All right, guys? So till next time, take care and I'll see you all soon. All right. Bye now.